one of the most requested items on playgrounds, swings. They've been around in one form or another since 1400 BC, give or take a year. I'm Erin from PlaygroundEquipment.com. Swings come in many forms and styles, and while the basics have remained the same, over the years, style, safety, and selection have evolved. Types of swing sets, hangers, connectors, and seats, PlaygroundEquipment.com is loaded with choices and how-tos. Let's start with swing types. Single post swings have a top rail supported by one post on each side. These swings are eight feet high. Several bays can be attached to allow several users at the same time. Arch post swings feature two arches on the side that hold the top rail in place. Multiple bays can be attached together as well. The tripod swing frame is available in eight foot, 10 foot, to a max of 12 foot heights for increased swinging potential. The tripod design is often favored over the bipod design for more sturdiness. But with modern steel technology and proper installation, both swings are similar in safety and sturdiness. Cantilever swings are designed for both younger and older riders. The cantilever is an extra attachment, perfect for preschool age children. The cantilever puts a swing at a slightly lower height with farther spaced hangers. This slows it down and prevents it from swinging too high. The main bays house two standard swings. You can be flexible with the number of swing seats, the size, and types of swings. T-swings have a unique T design for space saving equipment. Recommended for early childhood uses, the design helps prevent accidents and collisions. From swing types to swing hangers, PlaygroundEquipment.com's swing expert in residence, Michael, takes it from here. Uh, we stock three types of swing hangers here. Each one's a different size. We have a two and three eighths inch, a three and a half inch, and a five inch. Each one's galvanized steel. Each one has a special uh, bolt up top here. You'll need to have a special safety pin for it just to loosen and attach it. Um, this is where you'll attach your S-hooks, D-shackles, or H-shackles, and this will be your pendulum to let your swing and your chain move freely. Next step in the process is swing chains. We use 3 sixteenths of an inch. They can be sold in any variety of ways. We mostly sell by the foot or by the barrel. Next, we're going to move on to an H-shackle. As you can see, it's got an H and a letter shape to it. We'll do a similar process where we'll attach it through the, the chain once again. Then you need to attach the other side to your swing hanger pendulum one more time. Now we'll move on to the multi directional connectors. It'll hang downwards like this. It's mobile in 360 degrees to give you all points to pivot. Um, we do not have the connector right now to show you how it connects, but this is the style you will receive. So now we're going to attach the S-hook. What you'll need is your S-hook, you need your chain, and a pair of S-hook pliers. You'll use the threaded side of the pliers to attach the S-hook here. Lay your pliers down and squeeze. Finally, from top to bottom, your swing seats. This is a belt seat designed for children 2 to 12 years old. It has a steel core making it tamper proof and is sturdy enough for children to get on and off with ease. This is a bucket seat designed for children 6 months to 3 years old. It has a steel core and it provides extra support for young children. These here are your tire swings. These can be made from rubber or plastic, but this one is made from plastic. Included with that, you'll find your multi-directional pivot, which hangs from your top rail. Um, with the chain, you'll attach the galvanized side of the chain to the hanger, but we do not have the connector in-house right now. You will attach the web-coated side to this tire itself. And these are good with solo play or group play. Now we're going to show you how to change a belt and a bucket seat. You'll need your clevis tool, 
You have to insert it on the bolt here and loosen it all the way. And it's that easy, there you go. Thanks for watching our video today on swing sets, accessories, and parts. Be sure to click subscribe and check out our other videos from playgroundequipment.com.